months. First of all, I wish you all a very happy new year. It's a great pleasure to have you all here with us today. I would like to introduce our chief guest, Mr. Chong Kyung Kim, Consul General of Korea, who graciously accepted our invitation to join us today. I request our Vietnam President to honor our chief guest, giving our academy portfolio. So, thank you everyone uh, to come here for the, this wonderful exhibition. And the, first of all, I thank you, Mr. Kim, the Consul General of Korea, uh, who inaugurated this exhibition right now. And this is an exhibition. Not, we are like celebrating the 50 year of India and Korea relationship, which is already over, but you know, it is like, you know, because of the uh, renovation work, everything, we are waiting for this uh, exhibition. Because only uh, Lalit Kala Chennai, we have this Korea ceramic collection. And this is only one of the best collection of ceramic in India, which is all our artists, all our artists from India who done the work here before uh, maybe two, three years back and all we have very precious collection and uh, we in a very like difficulty we preserve in somehow all the works and uh, we have shifted all this work to some other place because this storage was renovating. So again, we are going taking back. So before going to their space, I just want to show to the Chennai people this ceramic collection. Because once it's going inside the store, again it come out, it's very difficult. It's almost uh, 20 years of ceramic, which we are displaying here. Like all very senior artists, uh, like uh, you know, some uh, some of our uh, like you know, very from starting from the Doros to other people also, and we have few South Indian artists like Dakshina Murthy, these sculptures also there. Before, how I must tell, ceramic is a very new thing for India because I've been to I've been to Korea and Japan. They have like 100 year old tradition of ceramic. So the studio pottery was started first by Lalit Kala Academy. Like we have center, like, like Chennai center, we have uh, Bhuvaneswar center, we have Lucknow center, we have Delhi center. Then we have like this small small center have a studio facility where the all artists start working ceramic. So it is a very difficult task for us because nobody knows about the technique, how to do ceramic and what is the possibilities and it was like a low level artwork in India. Even like you know, I met a lot of artists you know like Josna Bhatt. Josna Bhatt is a very senior artist uh, from ceramic from Badulora but she is passed away but she sells her artwork in 75 rupees. Because ceramic work is never sell, and the ceramic artist to survive is very difficult. Those period, so very less people they work with ceramic because also it's a fragile material. 
and to bring uh, to carry out also very difficult then there is a technical problem so in this now this time is now come i have been to two days back uh, to a gallery where there is a, a small market ceramic market the young young girls they are doing such a fabulous wonderful ceramic work then i asked them why you learn how you learn and how to get this technique then now all the techniques like is available in india fortunately we have the ready made clay available ready made glazes are available and there are few people who are in chennai who build up their own studio and teaching people that is a wonderful things like our gugar nail potterson they have started their own studio and trained people also so the basically the thing is to do ceramic is not important this is the thing is which are, which is with this technology is very behind in art art practice of india so let trained people first because south india we have very we have like one uh, which is the industry there vidarcha so i i know that people from chennai they carry their artwork to vidarcha for firing before but now maybe there is almost 50 kilns maybe in chennai that we are firing ceramic so all same as well as we have also in lalit kala academy also ceramic facilities so good good that you know everything is available now a medium is explored and people also pricing the first thing is how to price the art the painting always price in a very high high price you know ceramic and other work is very low price then now some artists also pricing very good their art work so so that the younger generation also getting encouraged so this is a good thing for us so now this month maybe is a very good thing for india because a lot of happy things happening in ceramic we have ceramic biennale also happening in delhi and uh, we are doing also this exhibition and a uh, lot of other small small exhibitions also happening next month maybe in pondicherry they have also the pottery market pottery market so ceramic is now uh, going to every home every place because we every day we drink tea in the cup ceramic cup but we don't know what is that ceramic cup how it is made so the people will not giving the value of that so uh, in this uh, i am just not talking so much thing about this you can see enjoy the art work and these are the few korean art work which we collected through camps which is with us our permanent collection wonderful work that also we exhibited and uh, in this i just request mr kim also uh, address few word to the audience thank you very much Uh, uh, good, good evening, everybody. Balanta, Anjali Smita in Korea. Uh, uh, thank you for coming here. And first of all, I want to congratulate this art exhibition titled Indo Korea uh, Ceramic Month. Uh, uh, so Korea and India uh, is a good friend. and uh, the relationship between two countries are getting stronger and strengthened uh, in, in the area of economics and in the area of the culture and people to people contact in particular uh, korea and tamil uh, we uh, share much in common in particular uh, we are sharing uh, many 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 vocabularies as you may know i uh if i list it uh umma abba uh we share umma so we uh umma is mommy abba is daddy same in korea so when i go outside in the playground i was surprised 
uh, by the uh, kids saying, Mama, Papa, uh, I'm, I'm surprised and I look behind whether they are Korean or not. So, uh, we, uh, as a consul general, I uh, arrived here last July. So, six months have passed. During my time for six months, I have been invited by many Indian uh, organizations, uh, companies, and government agencies. I came to know the uh, deep interest of Indian people uh, toward Korea and Korean culture. I want to thank you for your love uh, and love toward Korea. So I think uh, culture and art is very important uh, because uh, art and culture is, I think, I'm not a specialist, but it's a, it's a communication between artist and his or her masterpiece. During their job, working, there should be a communication. And also, uh, art and culture is a communication between the artist and the uh, uh, people who come. Uh, uh, so they need to communicate. The communication is, I think, very necessary to a peaceful uh, world peace. So without understanding of the other culture, we cannot be a friend. So I think uh, this Korea and India cultural exchange program, I welcome very well. I want to enjoy also this program. So in closing, I want to thank you all the way for coming here. So I want to say a very small greeting in Tamil language. I, I don't know how I remember. Uh, Korea, Yerkurutum, India, Birukum, Tamil, Tirukum, Orunala, Namba Nagal, Tunayaga, Tirukum. Thank you, Tamil. Thank you, Tamil. It's a So the exhibition today uh, on ceramic of a collection of Lalit Kala Academy Chennai, uh, we have like a very special collection of ceramic in Chennai center of Lalit Kala, so which we want to display today and which is inaugurated by Mr. Kim, Council General of Korea. So it is actually the theme uh, behind this that uh, just one month before we have a program from Ministry of Culture, Mera Matti and Mera Desh. So we collect some 300 uh, places uh, clay from uh, different places of Tamil Nadu and we send it to Delhi in that program. And from that day I decide to do some exhibition on uh, the clay work and uh, this is the that's why we are just planning uh, for our collection and when we open this is the opening show of our Lalit Kala Academy and you can see all over India all important artists exhibited uh, exhibition uh, his work is exhibited here as well as some Korean artists work also exhibited here thank you